On a recent trip to the Antarctic, where we had a, um, a client with a passion for, for whales, uh, we were able to connect him to Dr. Robert Pittman from NOAA uh, in the US, um, who'd been waiting for 15 years to conduct research into a new species of whale. We organized this expedition to look for a rare type of killer whale that uh, is virtually unknown to science. We described it a few years ago. We call it type D killer whale. Um, it lives in the most stormy oceans of the world, south of Cape Horn, and that's probably why we don't know much about it. It's a very distinctive whale, uh, has a very tiny eye patch and a big round head. Uh, it looks nothing like uh, a killer whale you would see at SeaWorld, and we think it's probably going to be a, a different species. So um, we managed to get some support, got contacted by the uh, uh, Cooks and Company, uh, asking whether I'd be interested in doing some killer whale research as part of a tour package that they were putting together down here. And I was absolutely floored when they got back and said, yeah, let's do this. Uh, and it was a, a high risk, high reward situation. No guarantee that uh, we're going to be able to do anything with this, but uh, it's not like going to SeaWorld. So uh, anyway, we, uh, we had one, one good weather day and uh, we found our animals on that day. Conservation has always been part of our DNA and it's one of our values and our clients share those values. You know, we're able to put them in touch or make those connections with our huge network of scientists, researchers and conservationists all over the world.